what you need for this project is a glass container, the fabric of your choosing, and also the ribbon of your choosing. Mine's about an inch and a half in width. Hot glue gun, and scissors. The first thing you want to do is measure out the amount of fabric you're going to use for the container. Leave about an inch worth of fabric just so that you can overlap it and later you can always trim off the excess. Try to cut the fabric as straight as possible. Oh, make it easier in the end to glue it. What I'm doing is measuring out how much fabric I'm going to be using for the container and then cutting the, all four ends as straight as possible. Next, I'm going to use the container and starting off with one of the ends, and I'm going to measure it to see how much extra fabric I have and need to cut, trim off. And again, you want to make sure that you cut as straight as possible. You want to pull the fabric as tight as possible without pulling off the end that you glued already. In this part, you want to make sure that you put a good amount of glue just so that it secures the fabric in place. Now, you want to start to cut off the extra fabric on the top. With this part, you don't have to be too careful because the ribbon is going to go over it, but you want to make sure that the fabric does not go over the rim of the container. The best way I found to cut this was to hold your scissors at an angle. Now, you're going to have a little bit of leftover like I did. All you're going to do is just trim that part off with your scissors. The last step in making your brush holder is the ribbon. You're going to want to measure the ribbon around the top, leaving about half an inch of extra ribbon so that you can overlap it and glue it. The ribbon that I use is this one that I got at Joann's for about $1.50. You're going to want to start the same place that you started your fabric and use quite a bit of hot glue just to make sure that the ribbon does not come off. Wrap it tightly around the container, and again, plenty of glue. Now this is what the container looks like with the brushes inside. I used two different kinds of beads, um, marble, colorful marbles, and then um, vase fillers from Joann Fabrics which cost around 6 or 7 bucks.